Builders and developers in the city of Columbia are making the old new again. News 19's Peyton Lewis learns about some old spaces getting a new face and talks about historic restoration in the area. A new bookstore, art installation, and two new event spaces are all being added to historic spaces in Columbia. The Columbia Design Development Review Commission has approved new art at the Olympia Mills Apartments and an event space at City Art on Lincoln Street. And one building the commission approved changes for 11 years ago has finally finished its complete renovation. You know, it, you could hide it behind walls where very few people get to see it, but it's such a pretty building. That's why I wanted to create a space where special memories are made. 701 Whaley has been open for years, but now the former pool area has been reworked. It's now a wedding venue and event space. Building co-owner Richard Burt says when he helped buy the building in 2011, the roof was collapsed and trees were growing through the middle. Many people thought it may just be easier to tear the building down, but he believed preserving Columbia history was more important. With enough people here doing historic preservation work, we can we can save the fabric that we have left in Columbia. Michael Biedenbaugh has worked in historic preservation for years and says he's happy to see more people around Columbia taking up the task of restoring and saving these old structures. It's a lesson to everybody out there that looks at old buildings and thinks they're too far gone. You're wrong. They can be saved. At the next commission meeting, there will be two historic pieces of land on the consent agenda. Reporting in Columbia, Peyton Lewis, News 19, WLTX. Well, the next Design Development Review Commission meeting takes place June 16th at 4 o'clock at Columbia City Hall.